Scorpios. So the first card we got reconciliation. All right. Second card we got closure. Third card we have love reversed. Okay, somebody could be wanting to come together with you, Leo. This is somebody that you may have ended it with. And um, I feel like this person could be wanting a second chance with you, Leo. Whoever this is, somebody could be wanting closure. Somebody wants closure, but I feel like this is somebody that you don't love anymore. Or maybe you never really had feelings for this person. But I am clearly seeing that a lot of my Leos are ending it with this person, calling it quits for good and loving up on themselves a lot more than anything. But we're going to clarify and see what else is happening. What else do we have, Spirit? Yeah, I just feel like a lot of y'all are going down another path, Leo. Like, literally. Maybe you told this person the truth. Or somebody that want to reconcile could be telling you the truth about something, Leo. They have something to say to the other person. And it could just be your energy, Leo, where you may have told them about themselves, about how they were stressing you out or how they was treating you in a way, Leo. And, um... Wow, page of pentacles right here. Some of y'all, this person may beg to come back in. But some of y'all may have been telling this person about what it is that you are getting ready to do as far as your talent, your skills, your money. You know what I'm saying? But I just feel like you don't want nothing to do with this person. I don't know why, but I feel like you could be wanting to separate yourself from somebody that may that could be coming back. Even though they may be trying to explain themselves, Leo, you may not want to hear it because you still want to move on. Your focus right now is focusing on something that you may be very passionate about doing. Some of y'all may um, could be making money off of a skill or a talent that you could be doing right now. Maybe you could have like a little side hustle, Leo, where you make money off of. But I am clearly getting that energy where something is being closed out in your life. And you could be starting over from scratch after leaving a love relationship, a relationship that you don't want anymore or you don't want nothing to do with. Yeah, you guys have a new beginning coming in, Leo, in regards of your stability or it could be love. But I am probably seeing this like you walking away from a soulmate connection after, you know, after you walked away from them, they come back and try to explain themselves. But you may be telling them, listen. I'm done with this. I don't want nothing to do with you no more. I'm more focused on my money right now. I'm about to start this business or I have just started this business and that's what I'm focusing on. Maybe you maybe you didn't say all of that. Some of y'all have, some of y'all did. But I just felt like you may have told them that you don't love them or you don't want nothing to do with them anymore, Leo. And um, you love yourself more, you know. You love yourself enough to walk away and go on, go off into something that is more stable in your life, Leo. Whatever talent, whatever skill that you have, Leo, that you make money off of, you definitely going to prosper with this Ace of Pentacles next to it. Because some of y'all definitely got like a little side hustle, whether you have already started it and is getting ready to take off or you are getting ready to start a, a side hustle. Just know that you will be able to make money off of it. That's exactly what it's saying. Wow. What else do we have, Spirit? What else do we have in a situation, Spirit? What else do we have in a situation, Spirit? What else do we have in a situation? Wow. We got the Five of Cups. Somebody is disappointed about the opportunities that you are getting, Leo. It's somebody that's trying to stop you from moving on, basically. 
maybe you told, like I said, some of y'all told this person that y'all started a business or a side hustle or something, what you, whatever it is that you make money off of. And they could be mad at that, to be honest, because you walking away from them is making you, you know, you basically better because you now you are exploring your talents, your skills, your hobbies, and whatever it else that you make money off of. And they mad about that because they skipped their blessing. We got the Wheel of Fortune reversed. This is somebody that may have wrote you off, Leo, at one point in time. Or maybe you wrote them off. I don't know. But I just felt like they could be hurt over a simple fact that they skipped their blessing, Leo. You were supposed to bless this person. But they turned around and ended it with you or you I mean, some of y'all ended it i feel like most of y'all ended it we're gonna have to see why in a minute but we got the emperor card reverse wow some of y'all this person could be going through unfortunate events in their life leo where they be, may be losing their job they may be losing their stability they may be losing their business but this is something that is definitely that definitely got them pissed off Put it like that. It's like you leaving them and leveling up, Leo, it hurts them for real. It, it really does. It hurts them because some of y'all's person may have tried to flex on you at one point in time. But now whatever they got going on, Leo, is flopping. It's definitely flopping in their life, Leo. And they are pissed off about that. Wow. Y'all blocked this person. Eight of Wands reversed. This is somebody that you blocked. And they may be very desperate to come back. Because like I said, some of y'all this person could be trying to beg to come back. And they only want to come back because they see you leveling up, Leo. You know, even though you still could be at your beginning stages of this level up, your person still wants another chance. And it's only because they doing they doing worse than you. That's the only reason why. You doing better than them. And they pissed off by that. They upset about you doing better than them. They don't like that. They may try to come in and be your friend. Some of y'all is a friend. It don't even have to be a love interest. This could just be a friend. They don't like to see you doing better than them. Some of y'all have some romantic love interest that you cut off. Or they maybe they cut you off at one point in time. But some of y'all, there could be people that could be wanting to come together with you Leo, and be your friend because you leveling up. Like I said, these people that ain't been talking to you, they been wasn't wasn't talking to you. Now all of a sudden you accept it. I'm telling you, they wrote you off, Leo. And now they want a second chance. Now they want another chance. Now they see who you really are. I'm telling you, Leo, whoever this is, they didn't know what you was capable of. They underestimated you. <laughs> whoever this is, they did not know what you was capable of. They didn't wrote you off. They didn't underestimate you, Leo. And everything. Try to make it try to flex on you to make it seem like they was better than you. Maybe they was around at one point in time, Leo, when you was going through your tough times. Maybe they seen you fall. Maybe they see you go through your tough times. But they underestimated you. They really did. They didn't know what you was capable of. That's all, that's all I keep hearing. And I don't even use these words, but that's what I heard. They wrote you off. They underestimated you. They did not know what you was capable of. We got the hangman. But you leaving these, per these people where they at, Leo. You leaving them where they at. Because at the end of the day, these people is not going to change anyways. Seven of Wands, yeah. you make making it very difficult for these people to come back in your life, Leo. We got the Eight of Wands. It was just reversed at the bottom of the deck. Now it's up, right? Yeah. Y'all got some good news coming in. That's exactly what it's saying. Y'all have been through a lot of challenges, Leo, where it's like they may have left you hanging. Some of y'all, these people did leave you hanging. Even though, like I said, they seen you go through your tough times, Leo. They seen you struggling with, and it wasn't offering no help, no support. Now that you are building yourself back up, I feel like you leaving them hanging. You build yourself back up alone. You had to do this by yourself. So what you're doing is protecting what it is that you are working on. 
you know, and you making it very difficult for these people to get a hold of you. I'm telling you, y'all got a lot of great things coming in. As long as you keep your guard up, Leo, and set these boundaries with these people, you will get your good news. You will get your blessing. And it's going to come out of nowhere, Leo. It's going to come out of nowhere, like literally. Like I said, some of y'all may have like a small business or a side hustle that you could be starting right now. You know, it's going to it's going to take off. It's going to prosper. Yeah, things may have been a bit shaky, but just know you didn't lose nothing. You ain't lose nothing. You will get, yeah, you will, things gonna start happening to you all at once. That's exactly what I just heard. A lot of great things are getting ready to happen to you all at once. Once you set these boundaries and leave these people hanging where they at. So spirit is saying, don't make impulsive moves. Don't make impulsive decisions. Don't take these people back because they want to ride on your cocktail because you went in for real. That's the only reason why they want to come back because they want to ride the wave. They want to ride. They want to ride the wave. You was just rolled off. You was just overlooked by these people while you were struggling. Now that you are, you know, making money off of your side hustle, off of your your talents, your skills, they want to come back all of a sudden. Now they grieving. No. Mm -mm. Don't feel bad for them because they ain't feel bad when you were struggling. Period. This is your new beginning right here. Spirit is giving you a whole brand new beginning. I'm telling y'all, this is something that you are very, very passionate about. Some of y'all about to get a new love interest. Whoever this is, this is somebody that you may be very sexually attracted to, or they may be very sexually attracted to you, Leo. But y'all be careful, because some of y'all too tempted to go back to somebody else that you have a, a sexual soul tie with. You know what I'm saying? And this person coming to take your peace. They're coming to take your blessings from you. That's exactly what it's saying. Some of y'all, y'all better not be tempted to go back into this energy because these people are definitely glued to you. Because that's what they want. They want to take your blessings. They want to take your happiness. They want to take your peace away from you, Leo. So y'all be careful with these energies right here. Some of y'all, if it is a new love, you're not meant to talk to nobody right now. That's exactly what I just heard for somebody. You are not meant to talk to nobody right now. You are meant to focus on whatever little side hustle, whatever little gig, whatever little money making idea you got going on. You supposed you supposed to be focusing on that only. You ain't supposed to be focused on no love interest. But just know that things will come together for you, Leo. And anything that was not giving you peace will be leaving your life. Period. I got a lot of response. This is another level up, but listen. This is also another responsibility that you have going on. But this is the end of it. The ending of stressful times. That's exactly what Spirit is saying. The ending of stressful times. Then I, I called it out. Some of y'all ain't even worried about commitment. Didn't I just say some of y'all ain't even supposed to be getting into love? Y'all supposed to be focused on y'all craft. Y'all ain't even, y'all don't even, y'all not even looking for a commitment right now. You just got out of a stressful period in your life, Leo, and now you're not even looking for love. You're not looking for a commitment right now. I feel like a lot of y'all could be changing y'all beliefs, you know, and, or, and how you look at other people that didn't have your back when you needed them, Leo. But one person, some of y'all had one person that had your, that had your back when you needed them. Because I'm seeing somebody hold on to one more wand. Out of all the people that seen you struggling, Leo, it was only one person when you really, really needed them that had your back, Leo. And this could be somebody a little bit older than you. You know what I'm saying? That's exactly what I'm seeing. And in a stressful times and in endings of any opposition that you once had in your life, Leo, any obstacles you had in your life is getting ready to be released. I'm telling you, any addictions you had is getting ready to, to be released, whether this is a person, place or thing. These people is going to be facing bad karma for how they did you, Leo. I'm telling you, they wrote you off. They underestimated you. They didn't know what she was capable of, but I'm going to go ahead and end it right here, Leo. Y'all take care.